what's up? Zach King here with Final Cut Pro Tutorial. I actually got a question from a subscriber this week on the Final Cut King website, and I just want to answer that question. They asked, how can I get a sound effect that's in Soundtrack Pro into Final Cut in the browser and use it in my timeline? Well, I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's go ahead and open up Soundtrack Pro. And let's go ahead and pick a sound effect. Let's grab a, a motion here, and we're going to go to Air Burst. Reverse. I'm going to right click on that sound effect and go reveal in finder. Now I'm in quit soundtrack pro because you don't need it anymore. And you're going to see here's the list and library of all the soundtrack pro sound effects. And it's highlighted the one I asked for air reverse burst. And you can drag this right into Final Cut Pro like so. And you can just drop and drag this into the timeline. If you're curious where your sound effects are actually held in your computer, they're here in your Mac library. Audio, we're going to go to Apple Loops, Apple, Soundtrack Pro, the middle one, and then Sound Ideas. This is where all your library of sound effects are that you have access to in Soundtrack Pro. But you can come directly here and get them. I would still get them in Soundtrack Pro and then do the right click and reveal. And you can get all your sound effects and you can drag them all into Final Cut Pro like that. So take care, FinalCutKing.com. Lots more tutorials coming at you this summer. Also new training courses available. Check it out. I'll talk to you guys later.